Alright, let's do this. What's up everyone? Empowered Q is here bringing you some more League of Legends action. We are going against the Crocodile Man himself, Renekton. I think Renekton is super duper strong right now. So, a little poke in there. I had my Conqueror proc first, so that gave me the lane control. Gotta be careful though, because Renekton has a lot of sustain. That's kind of how this, this good matchup is going to work. I'm going to try and damage him, and he's going to sustain through it. So, I was going to get that Empowered Attack off. Want to make sure I get some damage off there. I have, I have my Conqueror active, so I want to take advantage of that. So, yeah. I'm um, going to try and do a dash and trade. So, back up. Don't want to get hit by that. Cool. But, yeah, I'm going to get this Jin Zhao jungle, which is going to be really, really rough. Because um, if Renekton kind of dashes in and stuns me at the same time as Jin Zhao comes, it is going to be a rough day for me. So let's see how this goes. But like I said, do you see the power of Renekton sustain? So I don't want to fight him when he has his uh, full rage bar up. So I've got to wait till we have Conquer up as well. An enemy has been slain. Nice. Good stuff. If he comes on in, I can jump to a minion. God, jump, you piece of shit. Jump! <laughs> I'm like mashing my dang key. <laughs> That's cool. He blew flash and ignite. That's fine. I'm gonna grab a um one of these. That sucks. I thought um Rexai was gonna go in a little bit more, or else I would have like flash and made that more hyped play. But, gonna let this push out. Renekton's gonna back, spend his gold. So I wanna push out and do the same again. Cause he doesn't have teleport, so I wanna take advantage of that and get this push under tower, cause it's gonna push no matter what. Um, and I don't think I... He's just gonna dash in and poke me, so it's not really advantageous for me to freeze, I don't think. The idea here with Renekton is, he's a big lane bully, and I'm a big lane scaler. So if I can kind of negate the lane bullying part of the uh, lane phase, and just outscale him, I'll be in a much better position, so that's our goal here. So I want to get this. Like I said, just push this. Really? How did I miss that? That's dumb. I don't get how I missed that cannon minion, but that's okay. Um, and then I'm going to grab a Doran's Blade to give me some better combat stats against the Renekton. I'll actually theoretically have the same exact build as him. So we're both kind of in the same thought process. Yeah. Uh, Miz getting smoked by jungle pressure. Jin Zhao jungle right now is just ridiculous. So the more he's mid, the less... He's top. <laughs> Like I said, my goal here is to just not fight Renekton at the start. Um, so a little behind in CS, but that's okay. Like I said, I guess an Ignite lane, pretty much always going to be down CS. Not always, but now we can let this slow push, so that's fine. Renekton's, uh, not Renekton, Rek'Sai is top side, so no flash top. So I'm going to have Conqueror advantage, so I'm going to look to do a trade here. We'll just pop that, get a little damage off. Ready for battle. Big trade because he does not have... Um, just take a good angle here. Nice! Good, we saw him use that dash, so we knew we could get aggressive. Let the Rex I know that was perfect by him. So good job. Push this wave in. Want to deny as many minions as possible. Because like I said, um, Renekton does not have teleport to get back to lane. And I don't want to be in a spot where I'm really fighting him for prolonged periods of time until I scale up. Bring it on. Back it up. Man, they are getting wicked camped. Um, I'm going to rush a ninja tabby here. Get a 
can get a rejuvenation bead. The rejuve bead's gonna be nice because it's gonna be built into my Tiamat anyways. And then the uh, Ninja Tabby is going to help me take a lot less damage against Renekton. So that's going to be very, very helpful in the lane. Like I said, my goal here is to survive lane phase and make it into the late game. Um, so I got to start getting some vision down too because Renekton's been ganked a couple times. Jin Zhao has gotten mid a considerable lead, so we can expect him to probably start showing up top lane. That, back it up. it up. Yep. Use this flash. So I can just hold here. If he gets the stun. Kill him! Kill him! Woo! Scary. Oh god! I'm out. Oh man! Oh nice! I saw he was low enough and just re-engaged and hope for the best boys! I don't see Corky, so I'm super super nervous, so I'm just gonna back. That was beautiful by the Rek'Sai, my hero. Alright, I think I'm okay. At least the wave, wave is still gonna push, so that's gonna be okay. Cool, so I could get my Ninja Tabby here and get another long sword. Cool. Let them know to deep ward bot if I can they can. I have teleport advantage if they can get some lane priority. That was so good by the Rek'Sai. I love having a good jungler. <laughs> so this wave is gonna push out to me, so that's fine. Like I said, still a little down in CS, but not the end of the world. Uh, while Renekton's getting that wave pushed, I can look to grab Rift Scuttler too. Give myself some vision. Oh, jungler's right there. I got it back. I can't stay. That sucks. Oh well. What can you do? Walk back up to top the safe way. I'm gonna take... That to get back to lane just to be safe. Nice. Rek'Sai's putting in work. Nice. They might be looking to uh, Rift Herald. Nope, there's Jin Zhao. So if Renekton comes back to lane, I could play a little aggressively. He doesn't have any... Uh, rage, so I can get a little poke action in. Zone him off a little bit. That's the thing about Renekton, too, is he has to, like, keep auto-attacking to build up rage. So the less I let him do that, the better. That also prevents his Conqueror from being active. We knew okay, we see Jin Zhao, so we're okay there. That's cool. Back up. Popping potions. Bring it on. All right, I can go to make a roam here. Got the wave push. It's going to reset. I can get some deep vision right here. Let me add up. If uh, they could get that pushed, Oriana can. Lame. It's a good try. Oh, nice. Good stuff. I have to TP back top, but that's okay. We'll get my Tiamat and start building towards my Trinity Force. Oh, whoopsies. Renekton probably backed. So I'm going to push this wave in again. 
like I said, I'm avoiding fighting him, making plays around the map, gonna be in my best interest. And then I will eventually beat him in the split push. Because Renekton falls off late game. So how do I fix that? Is I make sure I skill too late game. Let's see here. We got some nice vision. Let's see what's his fury look like. Back it up. He's probably gonna double dash in. Now he's got full fury, so I want to be careful until my E's back up. What's it say? No E F me. The thing about Renekton is the normal rules to about fighting in mini waves doesn't apply because one empowered Q is going to completely destroy the whole wave. Okay, get some vision down. Not really in a good spot to find it, but I have my E now, so if he looks to dash in, I'm just going to pop my E. Nice. Back it up again. Keep an eye on the mini map. He has his Conqueror up, so be careful. Yeah, I have E in six seconds. Okay, I see Jin Zhao. Just gotta disengage. Keep popping potions. Alright, cool. Let me, myself just kinda heal up. Easy peasy. If he gets under tower, I can look to... Yeah, he's got to back up. Easy enough. Yeah, like I said, just disengage. Let my potions do the trick. Okay, he just dashed. Nope. Oh, he flashed it. If I had that stun, he would have died. Xin Zhao is at blue. Push this wave in and I can help... Uh, Come down. I have my stun up in two seconds. Yeah, he's dead. Just get the flash on him. I used my jump a little too early. I probably could have saved my flash, but it's not bad to guarantee the play. Oh god. Ooh. I didn't have my E up or else I would have used it earlier. That's okay though. Nice. I'm going to get out of here. Not bad, not bad. I usually do not like the Renekton matchup, but I think it's going pretty darn well, especially considering he has Ignite. I went head bottom. So. Let's see here. Renekton's going to push that top. They could try and cover there. I really want to go where the next, uh, the opposite direction of the next objective to pull people away from me. And that's the goal with the split push. So Dragon's the next objective. So realistically, I want to be top lane. But that's already slow pushing. So I can actually look to slow cl to clear this wave. And then make my way back top. So... Cleared that big wave out. Gotta be careful. Oh. No Jin Zhao's here. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Well, that was a good Wombo combo. I was really hoping that's what she was going to do, but... That was beautiful. How's that going? I could teleport if need be. Nope. Cool. Well, I could teleport in a couple seconds. Clear these ones real quick. Nice. Have enough for my uh, Trinity Force. Gonna go Sterix Gage next, and then I'll finish my Titanic.
Interesting. I just teleported really quickly top because I wasn't sure what. <laughs> oh, funny. I really don't advise using uh, the ward like I just did, but. Oh. <laughs> well, that was going to be a kill anyways. Can I get the 6-0 dream? Alright. Oh, come on. Okay. It's nice. Pop a potion here just to make sure I'm nice and healthy. Should be able to get this. I want to start positioning myself in a better spot. So I can run if I need to, just jump away. Nice. Can make my way here. See the Oriana. Oh, Thresh saved his life. I didn't have enough damage to pop him. Nice try. Yep, take their jungle. Definitely a good way to push a lead is to make sure you starve them of all their resources. Come on, Shelly, let's go. Let's see, no Oriana ult, so we gotta keep that in mind so we don't have that wombo combo action. So we gotta be careful here. Just make sure we cover Oriana. I think we back. Yeah. We've done enough here. Reset, spend some gold. See how close am I to I can at least get yeah the health component and the drone's fist. Extra health will be nice. Gotta clear one more wave. I see enough of them mid that I can clear this cannon wave. Cool. Back it up. Spend my gold. Now I can get the Jorma's Fist and the Pickaxe. Get a little uh, extra damage here. Sell my Doran's Blade. Surprise, I'm back. And head back top. Awesome. Season Zhao over there. Got Baron spawning soon, so I'm going to want to be with my team. I got two minutes left to uh, my teleport. Excuse me, so I don't want to be bottom lane yet. If my teleport was up, that'd be fine. We're enough ahead, though, by a long shot to Baron early. So, like I said, don't want to be split. We see the jungler, so it's a super easy play to make. And that'll probably be a good game, to be honest, if we play it right. Just gotta be ready to turn, so I'm gonna keep my vision over here. Nice. Got flash E. Just gonna push mid. Okay, head back top. Sees. They missed that one. Surprise. Who are they killing that? Oh, Renekton. It's like, who did they catch? Who walked into that? Nice. I can get my Steric Gauge whenever I go back. Uh, but I don't think I need it back yet. And my team's in a nice position for me to split push. So as long as they disengage or win the fight, preferably... Should be easy because I see Varus and Thresh were just there. It's on. <laughs> see ya. I'm out. Ah, oh, come on. I wanted the six and zero. Oh. Come on! Come in! 
I did have to flash out of there immediately, though, because if I got caught in the, uh, the Jin Zhao CC, it was not going to be pretty. There you go. I got my 6 and 0. 6 and 0. It's fine. 6 and 0. <laughs> worth. <laughs> totally worth. GG, well played. Yeah, uh, so like I said, the big thing about the Renekton matchup is understanding the way that his Fury works and then dodging out his W. So you have to trade the W for the E. So if he wastes his Rage on an Empowered W that doesn't do damage or stun you, then you can win the trade really easily. The other thing about this matchup is understanding the way dashes work in League of Legends. Um, if you actually... Your dash, until your dash is complete, the game is always where you think your initial starting position is. So, for example, if, if or my jump, for example. So, let's say, if I'm jumping and Renekton W's me here, that's he could do that because the game still thinks I'm right here until I fully complete the jump. Let me get in the picture. Then the movement isn't over, essentially. Uh, so, same with Renekton dash. That's why Darius grab works while Renekton is still dashing. Even if it doesn't look like he's hit, even if it's just a fraction of a millisecond until he completes the dash, the game still thinks he's at his original starting spot. So that works for when you stun him too. So just a kind of a couple different things to keep in mind. Definitely giving it to the Rek'Sai. Uh, but a fun matchup. I like it. Uh, the uh, Renekton matchup makes me kind of think of the uh, Fiora matchup, and it's a very skill-based matchup where it's cooldown for cooldown, you both have the possibility to win, and you have a large opportunity to outplay one another. So, let's check out some uh, damage charts. Number one damage. That's what's up. <laughs> well, I hope you guys liked that one. Um, oh, my bad. I don't know if I went over my runes. So, here they are right here. Pretty standard stuff. Um, Renekton is a very all any base champion, so I went Alacrity to kind of increase my attack speed for the all in there. Um, if you have little faith in your E dodging out his W, you could always go with the buffed Tenacity Legend, but honestly, like I said, you need to dodge his W in order to win the trade anyways. And then for the early game poke, I went more of the Resolve Tree. Uh, you could justify going with the Sorcery for some damage, but with his early game sustain, I like giving myself some extra sustain there. But I hope you guys like that one. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, all that good jazz. Share it with your buddies. Um, would really appreciate it. Uh, my Twitch info is also in the description. I'll put the rerun description on there as well. And please tune in next time. Later.